Daisha announced that she's pregnant with baby number two, but she had this to say. I hope y'all enjoyed my pregnancy reveal. It's been a long six months of hiding this shit. Like, it's been hard. A lot of people, like, some people has caught me, but everybody that seen me out a little bit and caught it a little bit, because I still was wearing, like, oversized clothes and still trying to hide it. Y'all, thank you for not spilling the beans before I did. I really just wanted the leisure of just being able literally just being able to dictate when my pregnancy got revealed because y'all know last time i didn't get to do so it was stolen it was stolen from me so i definitely wanted it to be on my terms when daisha was pregnant with dream she only told a handful of people and kayla nicole was one of those people so when the taylor girls got into it with kayla kayla told the world that daisha was pregnant before she did which i think kayla actually apologized for that y'all comment down below Nope. <laughs> Kiana J had this to say about her friend Carmen. Did you like Corey for Carmen? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Queen Nigel just purchased a Tesla, but she's getting rid of her Jeep and her G Wagon. And people are wondering why, being that Claris just purchased her that G Wagon five months ago. I don't know if y'all ever knew that I had a Jeep, um, but I had a purple Jeep Rubicon. I just returned my purple Jeep. I had a Jeep Rubicon. I absolutely like was in love with it so much. Clarence surprised me with the G Wagon back around my birthday last year in October. So of course, you know, when he got me the G Wagon, I was trying to drive the G Wagon more. Also because like, you know, he got it for me. I don't want to make it seem like I didn't like the gift or whatever. So I was driving the G Wagon more. And let's be clear, like it's still a, a Benz over Jeep, so I was driving it more. He got that for me because he he said I needed a pop-out car now to be honest with you I really didn't feel like I needed it needed a pop-out car because I don't pop out much when I do pop out out of state so like I don't drive out of state so yeah he was just like yeah you need to be you need to be bossy and this and that I was like okay yeah 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 you know so I, I, I drove the Jeep wagon and I and I did love it the navy blue interior it was fire and the only reason why he surprised me with that too is because the day that he was getting his Maybach I was there and I kept eyeballing a G-Wagon that same G-Wagon that he went and surprised me with I kept eyeballing it and so once he got his Maybach um I don't know why but when we talk about cars we get hyped or whatever so he was hyping me up a little bit and I was like maybe I should like get the maybe I should get the G-Wagon or whatever so me being like who I am I tried to call and see if I could trade my Jeep in because y'all I'm sorry like like, I don't care how much money I got. I don't, I don't need two cars. Like, I just don't. Like, that's, I'm a mom. Like, I drive to the same places. I take the kids to school, go to Target, and run errands. Like, that's what I do when I'm here at home. I don't need two cars. I just like my life to be simple. Like, I don't care how much money I have. I like a simple life. So, I was going to trade my, my Jeep in um, and see if I could just get the G-Wagon. Long story short, it was just too much. Like, the the monthly bill on the on the g wagon was going to be a lot so i was like forget it like i'll just keep what i have like i'm fine with it um and it's not that i'm broke or anything but it's just like why pay that much you know a month like like i said i like to simplify my life like just because you got money you know just be smart like don't be stupid all the time so um anyway yeah i just didn't end up going with it and then next thing you know my birthday comes and claire surprises me with the g-wagon and i'm happy because like i really did so yeah i was really really happy when he got me the g-wagon and i was like okay this is my baby i'm a driver but also i was still looking at the jeep like oh my poor baby like i just know you're not about to get driven as much so yeah she was just sitting there and mind you we had a three-car garage and at this point we had three cars now so oh yeah the maybach the jeep and the g-wagon so we had a three car garage and I knew that, um, I knew in my head that I was going to get Clarence a GT for his birthday. So I knew that we didn't need four cars and one of them had to go. So I just knew that it had to be the Jeep, but we're just now returning it because Ma was driving it for a little while because like, what was the point? It was just sitting there. So he was driving it or whatever. And we finally came back and just turned it in today. I know a lot of y'all were probably like, girl, why are you giving up the G wagon for a Tesla? But it was just like one day i woke up and i was like i don't want to be in a boxy car anymore and i know he had just got me that car so i kind of felt bad but i was like i'm just out i'm out
allowing the 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 jeep the jeep wagon that whole boxy truck feel and i wanted something more sleek something more feminine and something closer to just like mom cars and i felt like tesla's like tesla was perfect now i will say that so mind you clarence wanted to get me the tesla the very first time he bought me a car for my birthday when i was on tour and i it was the first day of my tour in Atlanta, and it was my birthday and i had on the all gold and he came and surprised me with the jeep i don't know if you guys knew if i find some pictures i'm gonna post them but the day that he surprised me with the jeep he really 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 wanted to get me the tesla but i kept saying like how much i liked it but i was also scared to ride an electric i mean drive an electric car so i guess when him and lee was communicating about the car um lee just was telling him get get you get her what she knows she's really going to want which is a jeep at the time and i really did want a jeep like that's what i wanted so yeah but this is how we got here to the tesla i'm probably gonna keep this car for a while like i'm i'm gonna keep this car probably for a long time and if i want to get another car i'll just get another car but for now like this is perfect for me i love it i i just love it like i love it so bad so bye bye to the jeep bye bye to the g-wagon i haven't turned a g-wagon yet i gotta have a little bit more time with it and like really really you know get my last moments with it but yeah your girl is team tessie now so we're gonna get her um tinted out so you don't see through it and then i'm probably gonna get like some red calibers on my on my rims or on my wheels the brake calibers and yeah so we went from this this right here it's a little dirty right now oh that's dirty I wasn't driving it though. To this. Okay, let me show y'all my G wagon. So I still got the wagon, right? So it's 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 big. It's a big body. It's real nice, right? So yes, this is real nice. The the blue interior, really nice in here, right? Only thing I was okay. So these are things that these are the cons of the G wagon for me. So I'm the kind of girl that needs like a lot of sunlight. So the sunroof to me, like I need a big sunroof. And then also the windshield is also like small, just like the Jeep, but who am I breath? It's small like the Jeep, but it's a little bit bigger than Jeep ones, but still, it's just like not as big as a, as a windshield as a, as a Tesla, right? So in here, the ports are only USB. Like, you know, there's no touch screen on here. So you got to move the, you got to move this thing, this knob around or like move the pad. And it's just so much easier when I'm driving to just be able to touch the screen. Tommy Lee had a lot to say about Krishan Rock's face tat. 